Question 23b says find the angle DAB. So we're trying to calculate the angle formed between these two diagonal edges of the triangle sides of the pyramid. Now we could do that through a long and complicated process of trigonometry, working out this angle here, but there's two facts that we've discovered in the previous question that should help us to solve this immediately. The height of our triangle was 7.07 centimetres. The bottom of this triangle was also 7.07 centimetres, which means this is an isosceles triangle, two of the sides of the same length. So if I have a triangle with two sides are exactly the same length, this is, oops, this is 90 degrees. We know that that line is the same length as that line. Both of these angles must be the same. So in triangle F, A, D, both these angles must be the same. So they both have to be 45 degrees. So if this angle at the top is 45 degrees, the total angle formed between both of these lines is just double that, so the answer will be 90 degrees. Just to make sure, because I haven't shown quite clearly where I got that from, it might also be an idea just to say the angle BAF is also equal 45 degrees, so 45 add 45 equals 90.